love to play and you're fun and you can always hungry for more that's just how I was born take me somewhere I don't know and give me your freedom whoa you love me to pieces yeah I need it once you pandemonium life is so easy So I gotta, here, you gotta, <laughs> you don't wanna say hi? We have to introduce you because I was like, some random girl on there. I gotta, I gotta chase you like I chased the kids. Yeah. Bye, Melissa. Bye. <laughs> A little late in the day, but here to take care of the turkeys and some chickens. What's going on, guys? And give me your freedom. Whoa, you love me to pieces. Yeah, I need it. Once you bend them on me, young. Life is so easy. Whoa, you love me to pieces. Yeah, I need it. All right, so just heard some squeaking and didn't know what it was, and I think I've got some mice or rabbits down in here. Rabbit. Oh man, so that's four or five, any more down here, I think that's it, okay I'm going to put them back and I'm going to cover them back up. Okay, so that was rabbits, baby rabbits, four of them. I'm gonna move this tractor up so their mom can get to them. Back in your home. Oof, wild day, you never know what you'll find. Rabbits under a chicken tractor, who knew? Hopefully that rabbit mama will keep taking care of them. We'll check on them tomorrow. Some would say I'm insane and they're rotting away But I just love to play and you're fun and your games Always hungry for more, that's just how I was born Take me somewhere, I don't know And give me your free Looks like we got our first egg starting to hatch From our mama hen slaying our, our meat birds See that little starting to crack out right there? I can feel it in there moving, it's so, so cool I love it when they start hatching out. You hear it in there too? Just pecking away. Say, let me out, let me out. Oh, and I wanted to point out, it's the 1723 that I had predicted. I think this is the only fertilized egg, so 
that was the only one that was gonna hatch and Jake was wrong. So Becky one and Jake zero. <laughs> Who's counting though, right? As long as they hatch out. What did you do? Did you just break an egg? Oh my gosh. She just broke an egg. Oh, and it's rotten. Mm, honey, why did you do that? Another reason why you want to take out the bad eggs because, oh man. She could step on it and it could stink really bad like it is now. She's eating it though. Oh gosh. Ooh. Okay, I put some new straw in there. And now I'm putting them back. Don't be breaking any more of them. Okay, time to check on the little baby chick to see if another one hatched out. Put these boards in here so this little thing won't fall out. She probably could still jump out, but we don't want the kitties to eat them either. So we gotta keep them out. I'd like to show you how they keep them warm. They've actually, I don't know if they pull out their feathers or they molt it right there. And they're next to their body skin is how they get the, the eggs the right temperature. And then when the chick is born, she could just sit right there in the middle of those feathers and be really warm. But that's that's kind of neat to see right there where she's kind of bald. Run, run, run! Give me your freedom. Yeah. <laughs>